Hey, hi everyone. This is Mukesh from learn-automation.com. In this video, we'll focus on how to solve not connected exception in Selenium WebDriver. So recently, Firefox have an update, and you must have updated your Firefox to a latest version that is either 47 or 48. So while running your test cases in uh, Firefox, you will get this exception. So we'll mainly deal how to solve this not connected exception in Selenium. So you can expect this question in interviews as well, how you solve not connected exception in Selenium. And this exception only comes through Firefox and uh, for other browsers, you won't get this issue. So let's talk about the background. So Firefox release so many uh, releases so they have the weekly release and monthly release so now you'll find two releases one is the stable release so currently the stable version you can say is 46 and they are in the development of version 47 and 48 so this is called the beta version so beta version means they're testing on it so based on the client feedback or users feedback they will make the changes so always make sure you have to work with the stable version. So as of now, latest uh, version is 48, but that is in beta. 47 is again not stable. So let's switch to the Firefox 46 that will work with Selenium. So you need to keep two things in your mind. You need to use the Selenium latest jars to avoid this issue. And yes, of course, Firefox stable release. So let me show you, I already have a small piece of code. What exactly I'm doing here, I'm simply type, uh, I'm starting a Firefox session here. I'm just redirecting to Google and just simply I want to type Mukesh. So you will notice once I right click and run this program. So it will take some time since Firefox is slow, but you will notice it will not run and you will get same exception, not connected exception 127.0.0.1. So this is our eclipse. Let's wait. So in the meanwhile, I will show you which version I'm using. So if I go to help section about Firefox, I'm using the latest version 47 and we'll discuss what is the latest release we have for Firefox. So that is 48. So you can see it's taking so much time to execute because we are using 47. And if you see the console window, it gives a very lengthy exception. So if you are a Selenium beginner, you will get scared of this exception. But don't worry if you see it giving you very meaningful exception like Firefox console output like it's not able to connect with that port. So what we need to do and this is the main exception it is not able to connect to the binary. So that is currently located here. So the issue is we are using 47 so either I have to use any older version of less than 47 so either you can use 30 34 40 41 but let's use the latest 46 so what i will do i will close this i have already downloaded three uh, setups so i have 35 41 and 46 so you can use any of these because they are lower than 47 but let's use the latest 46 so i will double click on it It will take some time to install this so how you can download the version so just type Firefox download file hippo 46 file hippo is the site where you can download all the browsers or all the softwares not only with browsers so if you see in file hippo we have the latest version 48 that is again in beta stage so don't use it and they have the older releases in the right panel. So you have 47, 47 beta. And sc scroll down. This is the latest release. 
46.0.1 but still I will go back and I will search exact 46 so yes you can use this fi Firefox 46.0 so whenever you find any uh, version with the beta don't use it so if you download this it will download I already have downloaded so I will not download again let me reinstall this so it will ask you to simply click on next click on standard click on next click on upgrade and after installing this Mozilla you need to do a setting like yeah let's launch it I don't want to update every time a new update comes so we will change the update settings so it will not update automatically what I will do I will press alt key from my keyboard or I will go from here so in the right panel sorry in the right side you will get this option so click here and click on options it's taking so much time to load yeah so once this options will load you have all these general settings search bar content applications privacy click on the advanced one here you will have this option for update so by default once you install first time this option will be checked automatically install update this is not recommended so let's select this like check for the update but let me choose whether to install them or you can select this as well but this seems promising so let's select the second one and again close the browser so that it can save the settings now you are done now if you simply go back to your program and if you run it now it will run without any error and I will close the browser as well once we are done so I will say driver dot quit so let's run it run as test ng test and it will run without any error so this is only for this particular uh, time so let's say in future you are getting more updates selenium will again come with 2.54 2.56 because they have to uh, match like which version available what uh, browsers are available what are the updates so they have to update their libraries as well so always make sure you are using the latest still you can see I'm using 2.52 but the latest is 2.53 and you can see now it's working fine it's executing my test as well so it's a very small video but yes it's mandatory because you might get stuck at your first point itself so try to do this and if you are still facing some issue then you can drop me an email so if possible we'll catch up separately so for more information you can visit www.learn-automation.com and thank you so much we'll catch you in the next video thank you